What's up guys, day two Lake Murray. Did did good yesterday, ended up second place with 95 inches. A little bit more than I expected to be honest with you. So hopefully we can duplicate that today, but <clears throat> it's a new day, new tournament. Um, gonna fish the same area, same spot. We got a little bit more kayak company today, but that's all right. Um, just gonna have to share the water a little bit more. I was kind of alone yesterday and now I think if I look from right here, I can see three on my bank besides me. So that's all right we'll uh fish around them and hopefully we can put five more good ones in the boat so got eight minutes till lines in we're gonna throw the uh throw a crankbait a bunch throw a little shaky head a bunch and hopefully we can uh make something happen so stay tuned and see what we can do thanks guys <clears throat> all right guys so i forgot to hit record but i caught a 12 inch this morning so we do have one This is kind of how yesterday morning went too. Slow. Fish number two, sixteen point seven five. Fifteen and a quarter. Not a big one, but this is a long stay again on that right here. Looks like the Fourteen two five. Fish number four, but we are getting wrapped today. That crankbait bite just isn't there like it was yesterday and having to really slow down around these docks, but I really just figured that out in the last couple of minutes, so 
see if that keeps going or not, but we can get another bite and expand on this a little bit and see if they're on docks or if it's just a few docks or what, but you can see. Somehow I snagged that one in the back. He was busting on bait over there, but or he just came out. Maybe I don't know what happened, but that's why. Eighteen incher, guys. Oh, struggling. Almost eleven o'clock. Seven five, a little bit of a bulk, not much. All right, guys, so that's a wrap on day two of Lake Murray. It was tough. I fished not great, not very clean. So I lost a bunch of fish. And Never got the big bites I needed, so got a limit. Did it? Did okay. Not not disappointed in it or anything. Just just wanted the way I fished. But we'll uh, 
Head back to the truck, load up, and go uh, see, see where we ended up. All right, guys, thanks for watching the day two of the uh, Lake Murray KBF Trail events. Um, like I just said there, you know, it was just a tougher day for me. It just lost a bunch of fish, didn't fish as clean as I could have, and that's just something that I gotta, you know, work on and get that get that worm dialed in a little bit better on, you know, them getting getting the hook and, you know, they were just pulling off or, or getting the back of the bait or whatever it was. But I lost a lot of fish on that worm and the couple on the crankbait too, and it just, you know, it just wasn't wasn't the best um, for me. And that's really all it is. So that's just fishing. Sometimes you just, sometimes you just don't catch them. So um, it was an awesome event. Like I said in my last video, I love that place. It's awesome that place is so much fun but really the same baits stuck to that same that same crankbait a little dt6 and the june bug i really threw this worm more that day um and i rig it on this little this is a quarter i either throw it on that quarter ounce or an eighth ounce little owner um shaky head hook so same full of baits that i used um i think i did catch one on that big trick worm again too that's just an eight and a half inch um, a little bit bigger but i throw it on the same head so you gotta let them eat it a little bit more that's the one that i throw on the casting rod um but and that one's typically on a quarter so that's really the you know three baits that i threw down there and just ground it out and never really found anything else but i'll put the standings up over here like i usually do and i'll put the top 10 this tournament ended up finishing in 25th so didn't have the the best finish but Got good points going into the Potomac. Um, I might slide into one more event in between, so we'll see um, see my availability and if I can make that one happen. So try to get into a couple more events this year. And like I said before, I'll keep making these videos and keep pushing them out so you guys can kind of get an idea of you know the tournament side of it and fit, like how I fish tournaments and whatever. And who knows, we'll start doing some other stuff too. But um, thanks a ton for watching, guys. Please remember to subscribe and like, comment, whatever, just so I can get a feel for how um how people are reacting to these videos so thanks a lot and i will see you guys in the next one